Hi. How goes it? Good. That's good. Not so good for women, though. So? Yeah. They're women. That's true. The United States government doesn't seem to care about women at all. Have they ever? No. Hey, welcome back to our stupid directions of Corbin. <laughs> I'm Brick. <laughs> and wow, America, uh, America, baby. That uh, sincerely, not in a good way. Sincerely, we can tell you, we're really happy that we live in California and not Texas or Georgia, because at least we've got that uh, until 2024. Then... Anyway, <sighs> that's not what this is about. No, it's not. Uh, but uh, but this yes, is, if you're it's... watching this, we're filming this today when the. When, uh, yeah. It's uh, America is going down the shitter. Uh, but you know who's not? The bad show of Bollywood, Shah Rukh Khan. He's celebrating 30 years in Bollywood today. What? 30 years. What? And I'm 30. So you can say, Shah Rukh Khan is my dad. I was going to say, I was going to phrase it sl- literally the, on my, m- my mouth, my tongue were the words, Shah Rukh Khan is your daddy. Yes, he is. He need, is your daddy. I need a shirt that says Shah Rukh yes, Khan, Khan is, is my, my daddy. daddy. Get on it! I and find it. some pose with him and Kajol and superimpose your face on her. Shabu Preferably Kana. with uh, big red lips right behind when you. He's kissing my neck. Yeah, with the big red lips behind you on that farm. <laughs> 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 Anyways, the Bad Shah. I think that's his nickname. The Bad Shah of is? Bollywood. The Bad Shah? I've never heard that. Uh, hold on. Uh, da, 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 do, 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 I, I didn't know that was his nickname. I thought it was Salami Nips. What's no, going on? I'm pretty sure it's. Well, no, like his official name. Uh, that is his official nickname. No, not here. Oh. Um, I could have swore. Yeah, I think it's like something like the Bad Shah of Bollywood. If he was truly a legend, like of all above all legends, we would be able to interview him in person, and he'd show up. And before he came, he would have done something so that while he was talking to us, he would open his shirt and he would have already taped big pieces of salami on his nipples, and made us eat it off of each oh nipple. <laughs> Anyways, that's my dream. Um, gotta live for something. This is kind of a, a an edit to celebrate Shah Rukh Khan's. 30 years in Bollywood. Um, so this isn't like an evolution thing. This is no. just like a highlight reel. The, well, it's a bunch of different stuff. Interviews, clips of him speaking, kind okay. of just to celebrate the, Got the, it. The, the biggest superstar in the world who can hope to have the fandom of is he Taylor really, Swift. Is he re- I was going to say, is he really the biggest superstar in the world? Because Kylie Minogue, she's pretty big. I don't know who that is. You don't remember Kylie Minogue? Oh, some of you do. Not bigger than Shah Rukh Khan. It was a joke. But it, like our intro, does it count? She's a girl. Not if she's from America. <laughs> um, but anyways, yeah, so this okay, is great. a little uh, edit to celebrate. Uh, sorry, Andrani's not here right now for that. She would enjoy, she enjoys all things SRK. Does she not enjoy some things SRK? No, she enjoys all things SRK. In fact, probably this evening we'll bust out our cosplay where I'm him and she's Kaj. Sorry, we spoiled a little too much. Actually, she'd, she'd be Ronnie McCurgis, who she'd be. <laughs> when I came to Mumbai to work, I'd lost everything in my life. So, you know, my parents, it was very sad. We had no money. I only had a sister who was rather unwell at that time. And uh, I just got married. I had no house. So you, I could not think anything can be worse than this. So in a strange way, the negativity in my life made me feel whatever I got, whether it was, you know. So I just went into work and I said, Yeah, Achahi yes, sir. Pretty famous line. So God of acting. I remember that. Ready, Rick? I like this remix. Me too. Chaya, 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 chaya,
Yeah, huh, that's right. Uh, SRK. Catch up, Bollywood. Uh, yeah, SRK. Uh, yeah, Shah Rukh Khan. Uh, yeah, that's what I'm talking about. His uh, name is Khan. Yeah. SRK. Uh, yeah, Shah Rukh Khan. Uh, yeah, looks better with a beard, right? Yeah. But what he's achieved is, is all his own work. I mean, the credit goes to the man himself, not to me. As I said before, he's my favorite. According to the power list, he is the most powerful man in the film industry today. And God knows nobody owns victory like he does. He's the dawn. Mr. Shah Khan. Mr. Shah Khan. This is. <laughs> I work so hard every year. I'll break my back, I'll break my feet, I'll break my head. But I make sure that all of you get some smiles when you see my film. Thank you. Oh He's got to do that little thing surprising fans like that they've been doing with yeah. a lot of next year. <laughs> We've been there. He did not show up for us, though. It's a good view. <laughs> Dave, they're like, who's that? Who's that dude with the white beard? <laughs> uh, I think Shah Rukh is extremely hard working and uh, so he deserves every bit of it. He's generating more. He's actually like, like creator of the creator of the He's just like creating energy and form, light and fun. I think Shah Rukh is God. One thing about Shah Rukh is he wishes happy. Uh, the speed with which his brain works. Shah Rukh has been incredible to work with. Shah Rukh Khan. I was very, very, very attached to my parents and I do miss them a lot. I do miss them a lot, especially now that I'm successful, because I would like them to see parts of it. Mm. Um, and I think the only way I can stop myself from going into depression, like my sister has, is to get up in the morning, wear makeup, and uh, be someone else. Of course, as Shah Rukh is one of Bollywood's most prominent, prominent actors who's been at the forefront of the Indian film and television industry for over 30 years. Forbes have called him one of the biggest movie stars in the world, and Newsweek have named him among 50 of the world's most powerful people. He's used his influence to help others. He's also the it's gotta feel awkward, man. Right? Foundation. When you're that, yeah. it's gotta feel awkward. Just people yelling these superlatives at you. Yeah. Hell yeah. Yeah. Hell can't yeah. wait. Can't wait. Romance. I'm <laughs> the last of the stars. You're the last of the stars. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's got to be awkward being at that level. Yeah, I and mean, to I'll, hear that actors get uh, that are that are known. Like y even here, you get actors like, um, like Andrew Garfield, Tom Holland, or 
and they're at a certain level, and they get it. They get it. Like, Even you know, at that you're, level, you're amazing. Yeah, and then but of course at, now, like at Pacino, people, but, Streep. At, I mean, the, the very few people at Shawn Khan's stardom level in terms no. of the amount of fandom he gets, no. and people calling him God. Essentially, no, like you're talking one percent of the one percent. Yeah. yeah, Michael, Michael Jackson. Jackson. It's that status. There's no actor in America that's at the level of, of SRK. No one comes close. It, yeah. The only thing that comes close are the, the superstars of music that we've had. And the closest I could think to that right now, and he's beloved by more people, would truly be like right now, flaming hot is Harry Styles and Taylor Swift, Adele. But even they don't touch. Technically, Johnny Depp right now. <laughs> yeah, yeah. He's but I. I but think even, even, he's not even. Not only in the numbers of people, but the kind of adulation. Like Letterman said, this doesn't happen in my house. I promise you, Bieber. No one's showing up at their house every week and putting numbers like that where the cops have to come just because there's nothing going on that week except we want to be at SRK's house. Yeah. Now he is. I don't think there's any argument that there's no bigger star. On mm. Earth, no, absolutely not. Nobody. <laughs> um, what's your favorite SRK movie? Not that's performance. Hard. Your favorite film? Not yeah, favorite I was gonna say because I my, I initially go to the actor. In yeah, me. yeah, yeah, no, no. Your favorite uh, um, film that you could watch most? Or is it still My Name Is Khan? No, I can't watch that one a lot because that one has some heaviness in it that I don't want to experience all the time. Yeah, uh, which is what's great about about great dramas like that. Um, that's a tough way. The one I could probably watch the most, even though it does get emotional as well, that I would just enjoy watching surprisingly would be Swadesh. Yeah, you could watch that. I could, I watch, could that. watch that one over and over again. It's got enough of the emotion to get me, but not make me feel down. I feel inspired at the end of Swadesh. Mm -hmm. um, there aren't points in that, and, and knowing how it's going to work. Um, and and it, you get the combination of the fun-loving... SRK and the grounded thespian. Mm -hmm. So that's probably my favorite yeah. one. What you same? The one no, I know for you it's no. Devdas for sure. Your ultimate. My favorites are the three that are about that's to come so next to you. They're going to be the best. But like, no, I could probably watch DDLJ is so fun. I could watch K3G over yeah, and K3G over. Yeah, K3G and DDLJ. They're right there. I don't have to think. They're so fun. I don't have to think at all. It's just you turn it on. You're like, oh, this song's laugh on. and have a good oh, time. Oh, Pooh's coming you know on the channel. Uh, I would say, I would say on a rainy day where you just want to have a fun. Kuch Kuch the high. The yes, those are just fun. Yeah, you could just turn him on and eat. And but, there's a the thing but, about Shah Rukh Khan; he has such charisma, and which is what we were saying. Your Zara, and, man. Yeah, your Zara. <laughs> um, I think you said that was your favorite, actually. It, it, that after, that is like after we watched it. But that's deep. Yeah. Again, like my name is Khan. There's some depth and emotion. I'm a, I'm crying at the end of your Zara. <laughs> there's a reason um, certain films like DDLJ, K3G, Kuch Kuch Dai work. Even though they're like might be over the top and and you know this kind yeah, of yeah 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 sometimes somebody would say cringe right stuff going on it's because he just has this charisma about him and it's endearing quality which is what wasn't working for me in the beginning of like Rangila they were trying to do similar kind of acting right and I was like okay but we don't have the right the the lovability of of the Shah Rukh Khan here even yeah. though obviously I think. Um, Amir Khan, I'm not saying Amir Khan doesn't have charisma. It's just different. It's very, uh, there's a likability factor that is there mm -hmm. um, that's different. And I think it's obvious if you're an SRK fan and you've watched them for a long, long time, every time you revisit those films, it just deepens. But I think that likability factor is there at the outset. Like, I'd really like to know people who see, like, for their very first SRK film, if it's DDLJ. I, I can't imagine they don't walk away if they're prepared mm -hmm. for the silliness. I can't imagine they don't walk away liking him you and feeling good with with him on screen. Also, something he said, he was like, um, the only way I can not go in depression is by putting on makeup and pretending to be somebody else. Yeah. And it's a very Johnny Depp thing. Very Johnny Depp thing. That's, uh, a lot of actors. A lot of, yeah, the, a lot of actors. A lot of actors don't actually like themselves. They, mm -hmm. they prefer being other they people. They prefer being other people. It's, yeah. It's more common than you would think. Yeah. Uh, it's it's the same stereotype of like a lot of comedians are are sad mm -hmm. and they they like to make people laugh because they themselves aren't joy filled inside happens a lot yeah yeah but 
Yeah, that was that was that was fine. Sorry, headphones. You might have had some yeah, issues yeah. with the sound. <laughs> the, the, that the might audio kind of went. <laughs> yeah, the audio was all, all not mixed the well. <laughs> but it was it's, clearly put together with yeah, love. Yeah, it was. Uh, it was clearly wonderful. And so, yeah. let us know uh, what your favorite Shah Rukh Khan film is, and what should be our next Shah Rukh Khan film. You know what we're watching next year? Oh, those three. <laughs> those three. But then also, did you hear about? Um, I don't know. You're not on Twitter, so you might not have heard. No, I know. Um, you know that road trip film with Priyanka and, and Karina mm-hmm. and Alia. Yeah, and Farhan was directing. Uh huh. He put it got shelved. Oh, and permanently. I don't know. Okay, but he's now working on Dawn Three. Okay, we gotta get on the Dawn <laughs> films now. It's, We've every, got to get on the Dawn films now. Everybody's very excited that uh, Farhan has now decided to start working on Dawn 3, uh, finally. I mean, I'm sh- he's just not working on the script. we got plenty of time. Hey, hey, if you need some white dudes who need to have their ass kicked by SRK, we'd oh. be pleased. I'll do it shirtless. <laughs> <laughs> Let us know what your favorite uh, Shower Khan film, what should be our next Shower Khan film that we should watch is down, down below. below. And happy 30 years to the Bollywood. Yeah, you look great for 85. Josh.